Hello, today we're going to show you how to install retractors into CNK202 product. The CNK202 is a new uh, tabletop unit that has a cover that can be hidden inside and you can see there's just an empty box with a cover and uh, we also have the, the plate which is a CNK IP210. I also installed the power module which is CNK IP200 and I also installed two brackets which is the CNK IP215 that we will use to uh, feed through uh, the retractors. So on the right hand side I have two retractors, HDMI retractors and a bracket that will hold those retractors. So one of the distinguishing marks on the CNK202 that you do not need under table brackets to hold it to the table. As you can see there's a retaining brackets on each side, there's four of them, and you will use the Allen wrench to push the screws right through here and it will secure to the side of the table. So first what we're going to do is to install the uh, CNK IP210 inside and you notice that we have multiple number of holes here so there's a one, two, three, four, five, six holes so you can lower the plate down if you want or you can raise it a little bit higher so I'm going to use a third hole right here location, a third hole to mount it inside so I'm going to turn it upside down Okay and what I will do is to close it first and turn it upside down and now I'm going to insert it with the power module ready to the front and it's just going to go right from the top and it will go right in okay. and we, we're going to align it to the third hole right here on the side there, the third hole so I'm going to use a screw that provi is provided with the, with the unit and then we'll do the same thing on the other end as you can see those uh, screws need to be inserted right in this location which is a little bit recessed so it may make it a little bit difficult but you can either use a magnetic screwdriver or you can just use a screw and put a little piece of paper in between and that will hold it nice and tight just like this and once you put it in just push it right through here and tie it down Okay, that's one end, and we do repeat the same thing on the other end, and then you can just remove the piece of paper that you put in right here on the screw. So there's always a way, if you do not have a magnetic screwdriver, just use a piece of paper, push it to the screw, and it will hold it just like a magnet. All right, now that we've done that, we can see that we have a tabletop unit with everything installed inside and now let's go ahead and secure the retractor. So this bracket will hold up to three retractors. In our case we have a power module in between so we cannot use a third retractor. But we will use retractor on the, on the back retractor for opening on the back for one opening and second opening and you can do two more retractors on the front. So I will take this unit and it will secure right here to the bracket. So let's go ahead and secure it. All of these are thumb screws and makes it easy to install it and remove those retractors if you need to modify something in the field. So here is your bracket holding two retractors. Here is your tabletop unit. And you can see when you mount it into the table, this bracket will mount under the table and the retractor will sit right below the unit. So I'm going to show how we're going to feed this through. So we're going to take this retractor, once it's installed in the table, you're going to feed this retractor right through here. Okay. And then you're going to mount two brackets that will hold the retractor. So let's go ahead and mount those brackets in. They're all mounted from the top, so there's no reason to have anything to do on the table. We'll put it inside. All right, as you can see, now we have a retractor cable going to the, uh, the opening there. The next thing is let's secure it with a screwdriver, with a screw. And you're going to need four of them, two on, each, two on each side. All right, one side is installed. You would do exactly the same thing on the other side. The final step would be to put a little grommet. So you put the grommet right through the cable and then install it right here into the hole 
and that will protect the cable from the metal. And now we're ready. So once you put this unit into the table, you mount this bracket on the table, mount retractors to the bracket and feed it through, and then install the final uh, brackets. The, if you're not using the hole in the middle, then we also have a plug. So you can come in here and just plug that hole like this. And then if you don't use the other hole, you can also plug it. And that's how you install a retractor with a mounting bracket for CNK202.